Hi, I'm just quickly going to show you how to uh, flash um, this GoTek drive. Um, I've done a few of these. I've used HXC firmware in the past, but this time I thought I would uh, try Flash Floppy as uh, Flash Floppy firmware is free. Um, so I'll just quickly show you how to do that. So um, what I've done is I've populated uh, the holes on the motherboard with these pins. So uh, when you buy one of these, it won't have these pins on. You'll have to uh, either just solder the wires directly in, or you can solder um, these header pins like I have here. Um, the other thing you're going to need is a um, converter um, from USB to uh, FTDI232 you can get these for a couple of pounds from eBay I'll send uh, sorry I'll put a link in the description and we're going to need um, some software to program the device a flash loader demonstrator again I'll put a link in there and we'll also need the firmware file um, which uh, I've put I'll put a link into, I'm going to uh, use this version 2.13 flash floppy firmware. I'll put a link uh, in the description for that as well. So um, the first thing we'll do is we'll plug in um, the cables. So we need 5 volts ground um, TX transmit and RX receive. And we need to connect from this device here into the GoTech. So I happen to know that the brown wire is uh, 5 volts and the white wire is ground which goes on to the 5 volts goes on to the end here and not the next pin although I think that is ground but the pin after I tend to do that for a bit of safety. Okay so that will be the power to the GoTech from our uh, USB serial device. And then the orange is transmit and blue is receive from here. I'll put a, uh, a link to a description of, uh, of these connections. The GoTek needs to be put into um, firmware program mode, which is these two button pins on the right here. Uh, you need to short those out. So I've got a, uh, a jumper. I'll put that on there. And that's that. That's too short it out. And then we want our orange wire onto the middle pin of the bottom five. Let's transmit to the third from the right. Receive to the fourth from the right. And then we can plug our USB into the PC. And because it's in firmware program mode, we won't actually see anything on the display. So we run our uh, demonstrator software. Um, just to show you what happens when you plug it in on the ports, you'll see. Um, a com with a number three, four, five, or six. Uh, this one's three, so you need that to select the three com three here. Click next, then. Now, I've actually uh, already programmed this one, but I'll go through the program procedure again. And when I did it the first time, I had to remove protection, which was this button. So you just click that button; it'll automatically remove the protection. And then you'll get a green light on the traffic light signal, and we can click next. Okay, then you'll see the device come up here. And click next again. And we want to download to device. Select that option. And then we select our firmware file by clicking the three dots button here. And we go to Flash floppy 2.13 
uh, I think <laughs> bear with me ah yeah what you have to select is the um, hex file here and we'll just go back there right okay so we've got flash floppy go take version 2.13 hex select that file click next so it'll erase what was there before and we're downloading to the go take drive again we'll not see anything on the display display yet but you will see the light flickering on the USB serial device. So I'll speed that up. Right, okay, that is complete and now download operation finished successfully. And that's the uh, drive firmware programmed in. So um, what we can do is disconnect the power, disconnect the read and write, take, our, take it out of uh, firmware program mode, can leave this jumper, oh, I could have done if I hadn't dropped it. Right, okay. We can take that jumper off and when we put the power back on just see what we get on the display. We get F dash F which denotes flash floppy. Okay, that's it. So next I'll be looking at uh, using this device in a computer. So thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you soon.